All right, hello everybody. How's it going? We're going uh, in the month of uh, November. This is probably my final month of covering uh, future notes because uh, you guys already know what's happening next month. All right, let's check things out. All right, I don't, I don't really want to see the the flashbang anymore. So okay, Whew. much better. Guild War will with. Co destroy co I don't even know what the fuck is this actually this looks like from Lord of the Rings or something dude <laughs> I don't know it kind of reminds me of the Lord of the Rings thing like you see the raves the race with the fucking giant sights and riding the bloody ass horses or something that kind of looks like dragons right yeah it actually looks like from Lord of the Rings or something <laughs> I don't know right I, I I don't know what is that thing called but like it you know those guys with the raves that you know when when frodo wears the ring right then those guys can actually know where that where frodo is or something it kind of reminds me of that for some reason it's like i don't know if, if maybe it's just me it, it kind of feels like it for some reason but yeah i guess that's kind of cool destroyer commander oh we got an update next level a honing seeker outfit loosely titled Will be available after earning a set number of owners. We do not know what is it now. Is it 200k now? First one is 100k, right? Now is it 200k? Wait, so is that an... Uh, oh god, I forgot. Is that how it looks like? The new one? How does the old one look like? <laughs> Wait, I forgot. How does it look like, the old one? It, does it have like the, the, the hoodie on or something? That's like a hoodie or something? Yeah, that's a hoodie, right? So now it doesn't have a hoodie on. <laughs> Basically, just took off the hoodie, the, the outer part of the clothes. That's it. And just let it like sit at the, on his waist or whatever. Wow. So, so cool. Uh. The Nazgul. Oh yeah, that's the name. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that, that. Dude, those those guys are fucking cool looking designs, man. I fucking love those, man. What's this? Oh. That's a penis. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why that? Dude, dude, they could have literally put it like somewhere else instead of like, you know, a line nicely straight like this. You know, they could literally put the ball like maybe slightly off. <laughs> the only listed change is that Golden Tyrant will drop more meat than before. What? Wait, really? <laughs> it's already really fast though. Because of the new change of the EX Plus, right? It's already so fast, so you can get even more now? <laughs> well, they, they, they really want us to not farm meat that much, hey. Damn, man, that's actually kind of nuts, hey. I wonder how long am I going to spend on it now? Because, I mean, ho hopefully, I'm I, I'm touching wood right now. Hopefully, nothing happens to me this 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 this, this, this guild war, Because <laughs> I do want to actually, like, you know, be around for that shit. Because I, I don't really know how long am I really going to sit there and, like, farm meat. Because the time when I was sick, right, in September, dude, I, I was barely farming meat at all, man. But I still managed to get so much, like, I think I did like 10k or something, or close to 10k, with very, very minimal effort, you know? Even though I was doing a, a one-button setup, you know, like, I just press Babu and attack, right? Which is kind of like normal, I suppose, especially with the whole, uh, the new update in the, the EX Plus, if, since he has so much HP, right? So it's not really that bad. I mean, I'm not really complaining, I guess, but like, I in at the same time, it could also kind of result in more people like bloating the, the honors, I guess. But at the same time, most like, like from what I remember, a lot of times November tends to be like the dead month for Guild War. Like in terms of like the amount of participants in Guild War, right? November is always tends to be like the, the lesser amount. Like not like on average, right? Usually the, the active ones tends to be like in either beginning of the year, you know, the, the Guild War after anniversary or something. Those ones are like super, super active, right? Because that's usually when people like, oh my God, anniversary, time to log in, dude. <laughs> you know? Because a bunch of seasoners gotta get their free rolls and such. Then after that they say, Oh, let's try Guild War. Like, um oh, apparently Guild War still sucks. Alright, fuck this. <laughs> right? So yeah. November, yeah, it's win. Man. <laughs> Starting November 15, running through November 27, that time I recorded at the Slime Collab event. This will be a two-part event and the second part will be a story unlocking on the 20th. 
Yeah, fuck that by the way. Can we all band together and say fuck it to this stupid event? I feel like, I feel like we can all agree to it, right? After clearing chapter 1, completing the ending event, which unlocks uh, blah 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 blah, will provide item to be there, okay. Win SSR will join your crew after you complete the ending of the event as well. Oh, so this is the other playable character. Yeah, I, I was kind of think that, thinking that he would actually be a summon because, you know, he's supposed to be a dragon, but I guess he's mostly in his human form now or something. <laughs> The other reveal in Korega is a silhouette for the event summon. That looks like a ship. Acquired by trading event materials. Also coming with a collab. Collab missions with plenty of rewards including eternities. Wait, so now they add dude this. You, you see what I mean? <laughs> dude, sand is like everywhere though now. That's why I feel like sand is not a pro- Getting sand is not a problem man. Sand is actually everywhere compared to like farming bars man. As for collab uh, gacha. Korega states that playing through the event will let you 10 rolls for free in a limited time. Only 10. Bro! <laughs> that is not the problem, bro! I don't. <laughs> hey guys, roll in this shit ass banner. Here's a 10 roll for free. This will guarantee you to get a new character. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. That is so fucking stupid, man. Holy shit. <laughs> dude, wait, wait. Hold on a second. Dude, they, they, they better still have us give us our 10, 10 roll ticket or whatever that we can use in any fan banner, okay? If, dude, I swear if they actually decided to swap that into this, right? I want to fucking murder them, bro. <laughs> we always get 10 rolls in collapse and you... Yeah, that's why, right? That's what I was trying to refer to. I, I would straight up murder them if that turns out to be this, eh? <laughs> November 21st is holding hands. That's illegal, guys. A collab event campaign. Oh, we have more MAGFest. Okay, cool. Wow, we have free daily draw, guys. Ah, oh, shit. Time to rank up again. All right, new players. You know, it's time. Time to uh, ignore the event completely and go sandbox, okay? Tails is not around. That's fine. But because you have this... Sandbox. Time to rank up, get to your rank 200 and, you know, stuff. So you get to unlock everything. Extra drops campaign starts on the 5th. So it starts by flight, fire, earth, and water. Dark and wind will be in December. QL. Okay, QL. what's this? On the 15th, updated categories to help filter the inventory. Cool, I guess. New collab filter for weapons. <laughs> Collab Summer Yukata Holiday Filter for Summons. Oh wait, that wasn't a- Wait, that's not in game yet? <laughs> yeah, because- because those- those- those summons are categorized as summon and shit- uh, summer already and shit, right? They have like their technically built-in tag already, you know? On the 28th, sorting weapons by whether with or without awakening level or locked or not locked and summons by locked. I mean, this looks pretty good though. This looks pretty nice to have. There are definitely times nowadays like Maybe like the last few months, I've been wanting to just check my awakening we weapons and stuff and it's annoying to find it, yeah. But uh, okay. On the 15th as well, after 10 years and 8 months, we will be able to copy paste raid IDs and core room IDs. There will be a copy button next to the raid ID. <laughs> I mean, I gotta hand it to Grand Blue Ian to actually mention this as well. <laughs> so they're trying to say that in so now when we click the in order before we uh pub right you know the pub button so we finally actually have a copy button there instead of like all right guys you know like every time i've been doing that on stream too right all right i just leave the fucking window up so you guys can type in because i'm too lazy to type down the damn thing <laughs> right that has always been a problem right oh man you know you know it's one of those it's one of those things right where the problem persists for so fucking long, I don't question it anymore. And I, I feel like that's basically a feature at that point. <laughs> yeah, and, 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 dude, the best part about this, the raid finders, the good raid finders we have back in the day, had that literally almost at the beginning. When, when those guys actually made those websites for the raid finders, right? The one that grabs from Twitter API or whatever. <laughs> Literally from the get go, right? The first function they added was copy pasta. <laughs> All we needed to do was click on the damn thing. The the red list was like, 
we just need to click and then it just copy paste for uh, i mean it basically copied into uh, your our basic our windows clipboard or whatever right that's what it was doing <laughs> On the 28th, an update will allow you to extend crew buffs rather than having them having to refresh them. It will only be available when there are less than 24 hours left in the buffs and extend button when extend. Why can't we just have it permanently, goddamn? <laughs> I don't get it. What why? <laughs> it's not like we really need to use a, a lot of uh what's the thing called? What's the rupees, right? To just fucking put it permanent, man. Oh my god. That's so hell annoying, man. Holy shit. It, do you know that my crew, this is like one of the biggest problems. It's like for some reason, right? Every time we uh, add like 72 hours, right? You know? Every time we put 72 hours. But at th like the, the usually it tends to happen like the, the ones that's active, which is the EU boys. So we always do that. And then when it goes off, like, like the, the buffs will always tend to go off when the EU boys are asleep. And I'm usually busy at that time. So nobody were able will be able to up, us that put up the, the crew bus for like eight hours or six hours or something. <laughs> and I don't really put it on like the I don't let ev and everyone, I only let like the FO and myself to only enable the, the crew buffs because every time when I and let everyone else, like the specialist guys to do it, right? For some reason they always fuck it up and it has been a thing for like the longest time now so i just leave i just left that in the, as it is on the 28th as well an update to the home page that will let you uh not only check the durations of your journey drops and crew bus but extend them from there without going great as with the above crew bus will only allow you to extend if there's less than 24 hours left there i actually really want that that looks actually that looks nice man i i, I think this cap looks nice i'm secretly uh, looking forward to Guild War to see how bad it is <laughs> because win sucks. <laughs> As for the GPS Fest stream, right, I, I might actually be able to join. I mean, like, stream, I mean. I might be able to stream it because usually they tend to do it on the weekend, right? So maybe I can do it. I, maybe I can actually join if, you know, the, the client is not making noise and shit. So maybe I can do it. Other than that, uh, this is most likely my final uh, Korega to like consistently being uh, posted on my YouTube now or even me checking out on stream whatever GG's